Ah, fuck you! Get off me! Did they kill me? Oh my god, I died here. Oh, stop eating me already, piss off. Hello everyone, Bubble Ninja 720 here bringing you part 11 of my playthrough for Resident Evil 3's remake. Last part, we were inside Spencer Memorial. Let's continue. <clears throat> now I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys this. <sighs> I was wondering, <clears throat> I was talking with Steps Basic and he was telling me that he had initially missed the combination for the safe that we had just seen over here in Spencer Memorial. <clears throat> He's already finished the game by, by now. And I, I'm not watching his content yet. We were milling about it. And I told him that I wanted to figure it out on my own. And I was looking at this and I was like, wait a second. This isn't trashable yet. So, And I was getting to thinking. Downstairs had a spot <clears throat> that I haven't been to yet. It was locked. So we're gonna go ahead and pop a dead door open. So let's get the moosey on. It's nice and cloudy outside right now so I don't have any t any sunlight glare on my TV. Um, yeah, we're going this way. A lot more people in there. There's three of them now. I remember only being one in there. That's gonna suck when they open up. Yep. Card reader. I knew there was some card reader or something. Could have sworn. Alright, what we got in here? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Grenade Central. Scour. Pardon me, I just woke up not too long ago. Ooh, document. So my voice is a little scratchy still. To all employees, we've been inundated with the reports of lost items. If you find something and it is unclear who it belongs to, do not take it home. Please deposit it in the nurse's station safe. The safe combination is nine clockwise and three counterclockwise. Thank you for your cooperation. Thank you for your uh, code. Ooh. Yes, ammo. Is that everything? Nope. Still got some goodies. Where the goodies at? Ooh, a green herb. Cool. Was that everything? Yep, that was everything. Almost got another full stack of that. And look at that. Time to put that sucker away. Don't go breaking out now. So, um, we were on our way to try and get a tape recording of Dr. Bard's voice. So that way we can open up the door to where he's at. We had gotten to the treatment room. And the treatment room had two hunters in it. So I'm going to try and figure out how the hell I'm going to figure this out. Do I have any reds? Nope, so you just gonna go away. And I'm gonna be a stickler. Alright, flashbangs. I got a bunch of flashbangs. I got a full set of nades. Hmm. I think I'm gonna try and be a. Uh, I think I'm gonna be. Try a bit of a sneak. I think you guys know what I'm going to try and do. And it's going to be something really, really stupid. 
<laughs> Alrighty, hang a left. And then hang a right. I think I unlocked the linen closet room door. Yeah, I did. We cleared these guys out, I think. Oh, the chica, chica's over in that way because I let her, I let her stray. All right, here comes the hunters. Oh, that made me jump. Oh shit! He can come through the doors. He can come through the doors. That's not kosher. That's not kosher. That is so not cool. Well, my initial plan is shot the shit. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Oh! You gonna come? You coming through? You know what? Screw it. Fuck you! I hate you betas! The gammas were too fucking easy and now the betas were like... ridiculous hard. I might not even have to use one of these. Shit. Oh shit, I need to reload. Abort for now. Oh! Can you not use this door? Wasted so much ammo on these bitches. Well, I got pretty much all my ammo back. Used all those grenades. Ugh. Where's my knife? Note to self those fuckers can use doors. <clears throat> got a cassette tape. All right. All right. Now, how do? Where do I have to go? It's not the staff room. I was going to lab reception. So probably be best for me to just. Hmm. We'll go back out through the linen closet. We'll go down the hallway. We'll take a straight shot out. I 
Oh, we gotta get this thing anyways. I forgot to get this. Wouldn't I have been a stoop? I believe it was 9-3. Ooh. Is that a dual mag? Yes! Yes! Give me that ammo. Alright, so these are empty. Oh yeah, there's a simple lock in there that I can't open up. I need a lock pick. Um... Got no more grenades. Oh, shit. I hear something that I do not like. Oh, I don't like that. No. I don't like that at all. Alright, so I have to cut through here. Oh, the emergency entrance? That's gonna fucking open up, ain't it? Or is there gonna be something here? Why is this area red? Oh, is it because of this simple lock? I really don't like this. I hear a lot of noises. Oh, there's a lot of them. That's going to open up. I just know it. It's just, this is going to open up. Alright, so I guess I'm just gonna make a break for it. Oh shit! No, just run! Just run! Just run! Just run! Just run! Oh ho 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 ho! Oh, but there's items in there. Hmm. There's a padlocked door? Can I go this way without being assaulted? I want to get to a save station and see if I can't find a, um... See if I can't find some more nades. Open up. Ugh, oh, I hate this. So much. Claire, where's your grenade launcher? I needs it. Oh, I don't have any grenades. Well. I guess I'm just SOL on that front. I'm gonna be honest. I flinched so friggin' hard when that beta just walked right out with me. Into the living room. Sorry, Claire. I, I mean, Jill. Why do I keep calling you Claire? Oh, I never even noticed that. Something tells me that those items in there are really worth it. It'd be a lot of killing, though. Oh, is he dead now? That's good. Yeah. 
Trying to get the head. Another quick headshot in on him, make sure he's down. Did I just pull Mike Tyson and take his ear off? I knew he wasn't dead yet. This better be worth it. You're locked. Really? I got fucking handgun ammo? Lame sauce. All I wanted to know was what the documents were doing in your office in the first place. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm goddamn Nathaniel Bard. I'm the best biologist you'll ever meet, you bed pen changing waste of a nursing degree. Of course I have connections higher up. Of course the military consults with me on projects beyond your comprehension. Hmm. So stop wasting my time with your nosy questions. I... Uh, I'm sorry, Doctor. You didn't read the documents, did you? No, I shredded them just like you asked. Good. Good. If that's all, you can go back to wiping your patient's ass. That's what they pay you for, right? And polish my shoes. Yes, sir. A bitch. No! Ah, oh, damn it. I wanted to listen to the entire thing. Damn. Sorry about that, folks. Fuck a duck. I'm going to listen to the entire thing. We're going to go put that away. Shit. I feel real bad about that. Sorry, everyone. Actually, you know what? I'm going to save this in a separate sp slot. And we're going to come back to that. I'm going to cut it in right here, what that entire thing says. There you go, folks. All I wanted to know was what the documents were doing in your office in the first place. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm goddamn Nathaniel Bard. I'm the best biologist you'll ever meet, you bed pen changing waste of a nursing degree. Of course I have connections higher up. Of course the military consults with me on projects beyond your comprehension. So stop wasting my time with your nosy questions. I... Uh, I'm sorry, Doctor. You didn't read the documents, did you? No, I shredded them just like you asked. Good. Good. If that's all, you can go back to wiping your patient's ass. That's what they pay you for, right? And polish my shoes. Yes, sir. I bet you know a lot about polishing, don't you? Now fuck off and don't say a word to anyone. Really wasn't that much. Wow. What a douche. Never mind. <laughs> Good job, Carlos. And we're back. Didn't miss too much. Lead some Ozzy. So many doors. Doors and corridors. How am I looking on an ammo? Almost 200 rounds only. Excuse me. Shouldn't have killed those Zambos. Shouldn't have killed the Zambos. I'll take it. There was a green herb somewhere around here. Oh, it's over there. 
Oh, I don't like this. Oh, you can't shoot him? Oh, you can't. Nope. I don't like this at all. Bard. Tyrell. Bard's dead. He's been shot. Shit. And the vaccine? I'm looking. Well, look harder. There's gotta be a computer, right? Right there. Banquet invitation. Dear Dr. Bard, it is my pleasure to cordially invite you to a banquet on September 10th at the Central at the Central Hotel, where we will be exchanging viewpoints on Raccoon City's new special medical zone, SMZ. Attending will be Mayor Michael Warden, Chief of Police Brian Irons, and other distinguished members of our community. We're basically sleazeballs. Thursday, September 10th, 1998, at 6 p.m., the Orient Restaurant, the Central Hotel, second floor. We would be honored if you joined us. Sincerely, Greg Tester, United States Senator. Handwritten note, Nate, I'll be introduced in... Well, I'll be introducing the bill for that new drug of yours in mid-August. Bring the cash. We've booked a suite for the usual after party. You're a brunette guy, right? I'll let Irons know. Ew. Sleazeball. Did they at least put a bullet in your head? I think they did. Good. I believe it was Nikolai that did it. Ooh, there's ammo. I left ammo back there? Where I leave ammo? Nope, it's in the corner. Handgun ammo. Psh, I don't need handgun ammo. Handgun ain't gonna do shit against a beta. I need me some assault bullets. Oh. I don't like that. Is that everything in here? For now, no. Nope. There we go! More assault juice! I don't like how that door is right there. Email from Nathaniel Bard. To Greg Tester, subject reply immediately. Greg, I know you're watching the news. This virus is going to devour the whole country. The dead will wash over Capitol Hill like a tidal wave. You're not safe. However, you've always been a good friend to me, so I'd like to offer you a way out. I have in my possession one dose of a vaccine for the virus. The Holy Grail. And it's not for my family. Not for my ladies on the side. No, Greg. I'm saving it for you. I know better than anyone that you're the future of the United States, but if you want the goods, Greg, you have to go. You have got to get me at the hell out of here now without Umbrella finding out. Lean on the Pentagon for me. I know you've got the clout. See if someone got, uh, can get a rescue team in here without U UBCS involvement. You scratch my back, I scratch yours, which should sound pretty chest after the parties we've been to. Hurry, my time is running out, Nate. This is VRC Chief Nathaniel Bard. September 29, 11 p.m. I am acutely aware that my time's running out. And I hope and pray by making this recording and bringing the truth to light that I can restore some small shred of honor to my name. <laughs> All of Raccoon City's suffering began with the release of a biological weapon known as the T-Virus. My employer, the Umbrella Corporation, engineered this virus. And they ordered my team to develop a vaccine, which we did. Now, I keep samples of this vaccine here in my office. The rest of it is stored underground. But those sons of bitches at the board, they want to destroy it. They don't want the world to know what they've done. So they're trying to erase all evidence that the virus ever existed. No, I'm not a fool. I know they don't want me to... <laughs> That's when he got shot in the head. By Nikolai. I got Julie all along. And she trusted me anyway. That's a hat. It's nice. Hey! Who thought? Who'd have thunk it? Brute force does open things sometimes. Is it here? And works on some. Uh, ooh, that's it. That's that purpley juice. Had to make sure that there's nothing else in here. But uh, which what was I gonna say? Uh, sometimes brute force does work with technology. Not really though. 
Yeah. Hang tight. All right. I have to go straight through lab reception, go around the bend, hit the reception, go to dip, 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 and I'm in here. I got it. Good. I'm headed your way. Be careful. Careful? <laughs> Have you seen this town? It'll be a fucking miracle if I get there in one piece. You'd pretty much want to get there in one piece, otherwise you're infected and dead. Ah, fuck a duck. How'd I knew it? I called it way too early. Way too fucking early, I called it. Now they're coming out of the fucking woodwork. I don't like this. Oh, shit! Oh, sorry if I blew out your ears on that one. But that genuinely scared the crud out of me. You're gonna be okay, Joe. Safe room! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh, ho. Heart rate. Oh, through the roof. Ugh. Alright, let's give this stuff to Jill. This is the reason why I was able to do this. Do you even know where to give that? No, wow, that is a big ass. Well, that's not as big of a needle that that would be. That's a weird syringe. Oh yeah, it's not even tested. Something tells me I'm gonna have to stand my ground. Oh, oh he got bit. Tyrell, what the hell happened? Attention all citizens. The contagion spreading throughout the city has been designated uncontainable. On October 1st, Raccoon City will be completely destroyed yeah. in a missile strike. I knew that was gonna happen. I mean, that's only a day away. There's still people in the city. You think Uncle Sam gives a shit? Mm -hmm. Fuck. Here they come. Oh, you sit tight. I got this. No, you fucking shoot too, dude. You better grab some gear. Sounds like there's a lot of them out there. Oh, there's some items in here. What's in here? Oh really? I'm gonna steal I'm gonna basically jack this guy's friggin' healing spray. Oh I don't like this. This is gonna suck. Yeah, I knew I was gonna have to stand my ground. I'm gonna try to lower the window shutters. The less entry points, the better. And how do we do that? I'll try hacking into the hospital security system. Keep them off me in the meantime. Thank God it's just zombies. Dude, you keep your handgun. Uh, you keep your weapons on you at all fucking times. A detonator. Now the fun shit begins. Where do I put this little doodad at? No, you don't. Fuck you. Oh, 
Ew. There's ammo over here to be had. Oh shit! I I work better with the assault rifle. Oh, you gotta be fucking shitting me. Jesus. I don't know where to go. Oh, the breaker's behind me. Oh, thanks for the hit pouch. Where the fuck's the breaker at? Damn it. Oh, fuck me sideways. Shitty titties. Ah, fuck you. Get off me! Did they kill me? Oh my god, I died here. Oh, stop eating me already and piss off. Damn it. Oh, it's an endless wave. Lovely. That's why they give me so much fucking ammo. All right. Um, I'm going to put the combat knife away for now. Cuz I'm not going to need it. All right, here we go. Okay. Now the punch should be Firing too widely.
In the crotch, bitch. Fuck. Oh, shit! Ah, shit. Fuck! Almost got it. No! God damn it. Get off me. That's the fucking breaker switch. Ah, shit. Oh. Nope. Not anymore. Oh, man. Did I do it? I think I did it. Oh my god, you're fucking kidding me. That's bullshit. They should have knocked them all out. Thank God. I wasn't in that room. Oh, that's perfect right there. Good thing you didn't bring the entire room down on you. <sighs> Carlos, you all right? Not even close. 
But at least it's over. I'm coming back. I need a hero. Vaccine's a real deal. Nice. Works Good. pretty quick. You going somewhere? You damn right. What do you think you're gonna do? Whole city's about to be microwaved. Come on, man. Call the government. Tell them we found a cure. You stall for time. Bosey motherfucker. Tyrell, you don't look too good. That's a lot of sweat on you, mate. Where am I heading? That was an aggravating portion of the game. <laughs> oh, am I back to jail? Please tell me Tyrell's not changing it. Fight him off. No jump scares, please. Where's Tyrell? You don't see the other side of the room. Look at the door. Oh, thank God. Where's Tyrell? Oh, thank God you're okay. I've got good news. It's over now. The city's safe. That was a nightmare. That's why I have a model of him as a zombie. I never seen them pounce like that. And that's why her light's so shitty. It's a shoulder mounted light. Where am I? What's going on? Oh. I felt the vital twinge. The missile strike on Raccoon City will occur in just hours. The payload is designed to eradicate all biological material. You will Interesting. Survive if you remain in the city. October 1st. Evacuate now. Repeat. No. Evacuate now. Can't be. This is not a test. I don't like how I don't see Tyrell yet. Ooh, I still have some mine rounds. What do I have in here? Mine rounds. Ooh. There's items in here for me to be had. What do we got? I got Jillian back. Ooh. I got a burst model gun. Hmm. All right. Um. What we got in here? I'm gonna go ahead and put these away for now. Wow, I've got a max stack of those. All right, so combine with another A to create explosive. Combine with an explosive B to make flame rounds. Oh, I don't even have another explosive B, so I can't make any acid rounds yet. Hmm. Well, that's just a shitty titty. We're going to bring those out for now. They swap them out. Nice. I have a high grade. I have another A to create explosive rounds. Could be B to make flame. Hmm. Burst model. Wait. Oh, yeah. We're going to put you away for now. I don't want to use the burst model because I, I tend to spray like wee All that other jazz. But anyways, I'm going to have to leave this here. Thank you all for watching part 11 of my playthrough for Resident Evil 3's remake. If you'd like to go ahead, give me a thumbs up by hitting that like button. Subscribe to my, con my channel if you haven't subscribed already. Keep up with that content. Comment down below. Let me know how I'm doing. No spoilers, please. And I'll catch you in part 12. See y'all later.